Hello everyone, I welcome you all to my channel. Today I am going to show you how to create a Java project with Maven in your NetBeans IDE. Now in my previous video, I have already shown you how to install Apache NetBeans IDE in your Windows 10 operating system and then I also show you how to create a simple Java and project in your NetBeans IDE. Now in this video, we are going to show you how to create a Java project with Maven. So let's begin. Now before firing up our Apache NetBeans IDE, let us first understand what is Maven. So what is Maven? Maven is basically you know is a very powerful project management tool that is you know based on this uh, project object model. It is basically used for project build, dependency and documentations. It simplifies the build process like AND. But you know it is much much advanced than AND. And in short term we can tell that Maven is basically a tool that can be used for building and managing any sort of Java project. Now let's see what Maven does. You know Maven, with the help of Maven we can easily build a project. We can easily add all jar files and other dependencies in our project. And also you know Maven is very very useful for a project while updating this central repository of jars and other dependencies. And you know what, apart from all this that Maven does, with the help of Maven, we can easily output our project into this jar and word types. All right. So I will also going to show you all that. So let's first uh, minimize that and let's fire up our Apache NetBeans. And in here, we are going to, you know, create a project with Maven. So now that this Apache NetBeans IDE has been rightly launched, as you can see in my previous video, I have shown you a simple Java and project where I have created this uh, hello world project. Now I am going to, you know, show you how to create a simple Maven project. So for that, just go to your file, then uh, click on this new project. And in here, you will be getting these options. So for which, you know, what I'll be doing is I'll be, you know, clicking on this Java with Maven. In my next video, I will also discuss with how to create a simple project with Java with Gradle. In my next video, I'm going to show that. Now in this video, Java with Mavi. So just simply click on that. And then under this uh, project section, just simply click on this Java application. And now just next. And in here, you need to give a project name. So the default project name is a uh, Mavin project. So for which, you know, I'm going to change this to Mavin uh, app. And in here, under this uh, group ID, uh, you need to give a company name, so delete G, and in here just type uh, your company name. Uh, I'll be typing Geeky, uh, Geeky Script. If you don't have any company, then you can just simply keep this all default and simply click on next. That's not an issue. So now that your package name has been, you know, updated to com.geekyscript.maven app, so just simply click on finish. So now as you can see that your Maven app project has been directly created over here. So just simply click on this plus icon to expand. And in here, if you see that you will be getting this dependency folder. For Java and project, if you just expand our previous project, you will be seeing that there is no dependencies, right? So as, as I have already mentioned in these slides that, you know, we can easily add jars and other dependency of the project easily using with the help of Maven. So you can rightly see over here that we have just created a simple Maven project and we got this dependency and Java dependency. This is going to be, you know, very handy when you make very uh, large project. All right. It handles all, all sort of dependency uh, very easily, you know. So in here, just, uh, you know, simply click on these uh, source packages. And then you will be seeing this package that is your com.geekscript.maven app. In here you will be seeing your company name. So just simply click on this package and then right click on it. Now in here just simply click on new to create a Java class. And here you will be seeing that this Java class. So just simply click on that. And in here you need to give a class name. So for which you know I will be giving a class name as a, uh, let's say main class. So as you can see 
that this is going to be our package com.geekscript.mavin app and our class name is main app a uh, class name is main class and uh, this is where this uh, the file is going to be created that is this main class dot java is uh, going to be created inside this directory so just uh, keep this all default and simply click on finish and now as you can see your main class dot java has been rightly created over here uh, you will also get the author name uh, by, by your uh, system username so you can uh, uh, if you wish you can delete that uh, or you can uh, you know uh, keep this all default and then just uh, simply proceed with your work so in here we are we are first going to you know uh, create our main method so for that uh, the simple way is psvm public static void main and then just simply click on tab for public static void main all right this is uh, you know very uh, good features of this uh, java related ids you can also uh, use that feature in uh, uh, netbeans, uh, netbeans id to what we are using you can also use these features to uh, you know intel ij id eclipse id all all these ids support these features now we are going to you know simply print so for that just uh, you know uh, ace out and then again tap for system dot uh, for system out dot println and now just simply you know hello world from uh, or the main class now just simply click on this uh, save icon yeah and now just simply click on this run button and now as you can see a pop-up came that is uh, saying that select main class for ex execution so the available main class is this com.geekscript.mavinapp.main class so that is our main class uh, and it's saying that remember in a current IDE session so just uh, keep this all default and then just simply click on select main class yeah for execution and now you know you need to have an active internet connection right throughout this you know project creation and all so for that as you can see that they basically going to you know download some libraries as we have already said that they basically you know uh, going to create some dependencies all these are going to be very very useful for your projects you know so they they are basically you know currently downloading some uh, libraries at the back end so just uh, give a couple of minutes to download that so now as you can see that this enter download process has been completed and also our project has been run properly without error and as you can see this hello world from main class has been rightly shown over here you can also simply create a new class just for that just simply uh, click on our package name now just simply right click on it and now just go hover over this new and then java class and in here we will be you know uh, creating another class uh, naming uh, demo class so our package name is com.geekscript.mavinapp so and and our demo class is going to be you know created over this directory so keep this all default then just simply click on finish and now that you can see that your demo class has been rightly created over here so so here we are going to you know create a simple method so for that just simply type public void demo method we are basically creating a demo method over this demo class and now just simply s out for system out dot print and in here we are going to you know print hello world from demo class and now just you know simple uh, save this and go to this uh, main class and inside main class we are going to sorry and inside main class we are going to you know creating a object of our newly created class that is this demo class so demo class dc equal to new demo class that is our constructor and now in here we are going to you know call our method so for that just uh, dc that is name of name of our object then dot and our method name is demo so just simply click on that now what we are going to see is hello world from our main class first and then we are basically going to triggering our demo method from this demo class that is this hello world from demo class so go to our main class and then just simply click on this uh, run button for execution and now as you can see this uh, maven project is currently running 
and in the end and in the output console you can clearly see this hello world from our main class and hello world from our demo class all right so in this way you know you basically create a maven project in your netbeans ide i have shown you all steps the first thing first you need to save this project to run all right otherwise you know you will be seeing that this main class not found and and all other stuffs so you need to save that project before running all right so that's one aspect and also you need to have a rightly uh, and also you need to have an internet connection right throughout this uh, project creation after you know downloading of all the libraries you uh, don't need to have any internet connection that that will be not issue but during creation of the project you need to have an internet connection all right so that's all for this video friends if you have any queries you can you know comment in our comment sections i am always there to you know help you so that's all for this video friends do subscribe our channel and also please do share with your friends it will be it will help help our channel to grow so that's all for this video friends thank you very much for watching this video and god bless you